Jesse Vargas, Adrian Broner, this weekend at the Barclays Center in New York. What we're gonna do here is explain and give you a simple breakdown of what has to happen for each fighter. Now, let's just say Adrian Broner hasn't been at the top of this game as of late, but with the right strategy, everybody can overcome any situation in the sport of boxing. Now, Jesse Vargas has been sort of on a tear lately. He's been winning and he's definitely ready. Now he has a new coach. He's getting ready to step into the ring. They both have actually have a new coach. So, one of the things, staying conventional, all right? Jesse Vargas throws a lot of punches, so throw four, six, ten. What you see is Adrian Broner is burst out of the Philly shell. In order for Jesse Vargas to actually win this fight, time. In, in, in order for Jesse Vargas to win this fight, that's what he'll have to do. He has to stay on top of Adrian Broner. So you throw the shots, you come at me throwing the shots, and you have to smother, you'll have to smother Adrian Broner's counterpunch style. That's the key to his victory. More punches, higher output, constant pressure, cutting off the ring. Adrian Broner decides to move around the ring. He'll have to try to break the rope. He'll have to cut him off. He'll have to go to stop the, 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 the highly skilled Adrian Broner. Now, that's Jesse Vargas' key to victory. It's a good chance that he'll execute this. Now, in order for Adrian Broner to win, you get in the Philly shell. You start throwing shots. He'll have to stop by getting inside, getting in the crowds, coming up, clinching, turning them, and then start throwing his own combinations over and over and over again, making it a boring but ugly fight. He has such a high output in offense, Jesse Vargas, and that's the key. Adrian Broner, he gets in the paint, he blocks, boom, he steps in, he turns him, he starts off his own offense, breaking the rhythm of Jesse Vargas constantly throughout the entire night and keeping a jab on him after he turns and throws the combination, pop, pop. That's the key to his victory. It doesn't matter what he's bringing in there. If he doesn't bring that component, it's going to be a very long night because Jesse Vargas throws a lot of punches. And that's all I got, man. Keep following us. This is Coach Eric Bradley. My man, say your name, Brandon. Brandon <laughs> In the Wild Prince. Prince, you already know. My man. This is Master Boxing. You get your masters in boxing. Peace out. Be blessed. Godspeed.